<laughs> What's going on, folks? Welcome to Leon Falu. And welcome to the Duna Kanya. We're out here in front of the Gomba Buffet, the Mushroom Buffet. Closed until March, regrettably. But a lovely place for a drink and a bite. And there's the gorgeous Danube, the Duna. Behind us, we've got the Pilish Mountains. And we're gonna hop on our bike here so I can show you just how easy it is to get a little bit of adventure outside the city. All right, let's just get the, ooh, <laughs> the helmet cam fixed on here. Now they call this area the Duna Kanyar because it's where the Danube bends. The Duna being the Danube, the Kanyar being the bend. And it bends and it curves like a hook up around Visegrad. So I say, why not let's ride along the lovely path and we can see, see what we for the do fine. In Leanfalu, across the way there, is Pochmedje on the Saint Andre Siget. That's a whole nother kettle of fish. All right, well, we started off here, okay, with a little bit of off-roading, which probably, ah, fuck, go into a lower gear. Ay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> This is not the uh, recommended route. Woo! Let's go, baby! Okay, finally, Route 11. Route 11. It's Tahi Tofalu. That's our next stop. Tahi Tofalu. All right, so we're here in downtown Tahi Tofalu. We can see the hills heading back that way. The signs of Vats for the ferry, Kishirosi, Sigit Monastor, and the rest of Tahi Tofalu. There's the Tahi Tofalu Korman Ablak. Probably my least favorite place in the entire world. Til di Zoltan. The Til di Zoltan Hid. The Til di Zoltan The Til di Zoltan And now you're gonna believe this. And so we're here on the Til di Zoltan Hid. We can see the Danube, how it's starting to bend down that way. Over in that direction is Budapest. On that side, we have Tahi and the Pilish Mountains. And down there on the island is Tothfalu. Of course, now they are one town, Tahi Tothfalu. We're gonna go ahead in and explore the Tothfalu section. Well, here we are in Totfalu. You can see on the side of the wall there, 1911, Ezer Kielan Sas Tizen Edge. And there is the 19th century Reformatus Templum. You know, 1911 is actually rather young for this village. It's an old, old, old ancient settlement. Wow, such a privilege to be here on a lovely day at the end of February. So here we've got Hushuk Tere in Tahi Tofalu. And this lovely memorial is topped by the Turul bird, of course, with the Hungarian flag overhead. And it's dedicated to the heroes who lost their lives in World War I and World War II. Just watched All Quiet on the Western Front this morning. World War I, what a horrific, horrific tragedy that was for humankind. Here on Chief Arpad Utsa, we've got the easy, easy, vegesh kereskeresh. Try saying that six times fast. Vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh, vegesh kereskeresh. A lot of mixed things there. Vegesh in Hungarian. That means mixed. Well, on Saint Istvan Ter, we've got the Tahi Tofalu flag let's get a closer look at that beautiful castle sigil oh what a shot <laughs> right outside the render shake and there is the catholic church built between 1801 and 1805 beginning of the 19th century you can see they're putting a new hat on the top they seem to be doing a lot of rehatting of the catholic churches in hungary we just stopped by estergom the other day and they were putting a huge 
new headpiece on the top of the basilica. Now we sweep down these charming, charming, charming streets of Tahi Totfalu. You may be wondering why it's called Totfalu. Well, I'm about to tell you in just a moment. Look at this guy, the Vondor, the Wanderer. Oh, ho. I love a good old bazaar village statue. So you see, Falu means village. Like I live in Leon Falu, which is the girls' village. And this is Tahi, as we said before, over in the hills, Tot Falu, the Tot village. And what's a tot? This is how they handle a lot of the sewage out on the island. You know, it's very hard to get centralized sewage in an island like this. So they have to pump a lot of it out of the ground with these trucks. Not the most uh, beautiful thing in the world, but it is efficient. So a tote is back in the day, what they used to call any sort of Slovene, Slovak, Slav settler to Hungary. They were called totes. And this town happened to be settled by a whole lot of totes. And by the 14th century, we already see this place popping up in a lot of documentation as Tot Falu, the Slav village. Falushi Tekergu. What's a Tekergu? Anyone know what a Tekergu is? Here's the Faluhas, which is the village house. Usually at a Faluhas, oh look at these old, ho oh, ho, these old bricks, I love it. At a Falu house, you can get a nice taste of for what life used to be like. At a Falu house, closed, closed, closed. We'll have to come back another time. You can see the ancient chimney there, right in the center. What do we got over here? Erkesh, Erkesh, Erkesh. As ego. Yikes. As eager shag. Felemeli, a nemzeteta boon pedigiala zataravana nepeknek. Huh. Here's the Tahi Tofalu sigil, quite lovely, etched into the clay. We got the star, we got the moon, the chilag, the holds, the madar, and the var. Oh. Ah, 50th anniversary of 1956, carved into wood. I wonder if this tea right here is for Tahi Totfalu. Tahi Totfalu. You know, the Seaget, it's lined by four towns. Kishorosi, or Little Russia, which is there. Here, Totfalu, Tahi Totfalu, the Slav village. And then you got Pochmajer and Seaget Monastor, along with the resort areas of Horan and Shuran. Oh, look at the glazing. Ho ho. Look at this glazing. Oh, lovely. I wonder if it was uh, processed by the Jolme factory down in Peach. Oh my. Oh. What fortuitous timing. What fortuitous timing indeed. Hidden nooks and crannies down by the Reformatus Templum. Another 19th century construction. Well, that was a bit lucky. All right, that's all we got. Is this a well? Whoa, it's an actual well. That's amazing. Oh, nooks and crannies. Crannies and nooks. Yes. Oh, lovely little treehouse there. Here on Adi Andre Utsa, we can see some of the colorful, distinctive village houses. How characteristic. Again with the teas. Oh, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Tista Udvar Rendesh House. 
colorful as you'd like. And here we have some Ariandre Vesh. Mbetek vajok, ej kish falubo, leshkadum visa a vilagba, hide grazo, shemle kezeshe, hata ulduznek, hata hata. Felek a sugarash napokon, mindin kichi, lata sto felek. Shaha ha blakon bol, messe zelatok, resketesh nyug benema lelek. Mindin agast, mindin fine nekem, a mia mutam visa hosa, terut horoizan. Uzenet fein, shetet shohaitash, hier la poshta. Mindin tu felek, nyug tano nul, ma ninche alva shom she almom, en ishtenem hodjan ish fuguk. Ezen a zord e let par canyon. Den neha regel kesik a fen, s ülük büsken, dülfüs, ürümben. Küd a falun e sén ezem jól, hogy biztos vagyok e szent künben. Hm. Ari Endre. Wow, so Clary, the lovely owner of this beautiful house, tells me that it's over 200 years old. It belonged to her great grandmother. Oh. Gorgeous. Really lifts the spirits. <laughs> Shushu. A shotgun. Oh. Wow. All right. All right. Tahi tofalushi machika. Oh, see a machika. Yunyuru tahi tofalushi machika. Wow. Now, you know, tahi tofalu, as well as much of the sea gets, became a bastion, a safe haven during the Turkish era. While most of the country, especially around Budapest, was taken over, this area, it was a little bit harder to govern, harder to manage. And these settlements, they began to consolidate their independent, unique, authentic, cultural flavor during those days. I wonder if one of this lovely Tahi Tofalushi Machka's ancestors we're there then as well. Okay, I'll see you later, my friend. Have a nice time. Oh, she doesn't want to leave. Beautiful Machka. Meow. Oh my goodness. Imadom, 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 imadom. All right, here we got the Laki Tsuki Konditori Tukras, the coffee house. There is the Cake Duna Borzo. Let's go stop by a local Borzo for a little drink. Oh, cozy seven. Najan, you are a Bosarkan. Yen, you do. Shock. Shock Regi, Regi Dologit. Ah, <laughs> 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 Action to show joke. New Yorkie. Fella Shinga Maja. And the Aban Aswandiuk. Hidegeb mint a Bosorkan Titia. Savas. Wow. Enter as strangers, leave as friends. Now let's go ride back to Leonfalu and take a little stroll down the Duna. It's not really a stroll if you got a bike, is it? Look at this. Eze Nyotsas Hatvan Ut. Wow. What a cat. <laughs> You know, in the winter time, it's a bit empty. But come the spring and the summer, this is a place that must be seen to be believed. And there's so much more island to explore. 
if you're visiting Hungary, or maybe if you live here and you just want to see something new, get in touch with me, come visit me, haveago.co. We're gonna go explore together. This is a place to get lost in time and nature and beauty. On the Duna Kanya, where the Danube bends, and now our story, it must come to an end. Do -do -do. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in folks. If you enjoyed that video and you'd like to see more, think about joining our YouTube members page. Join, 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 J-O-I-N, join. And we're back at the Gomba. What a day, what a place, what a world. The Duna Kanya. Oh, oh. Show the latos. Show the latos.